Notion is one of the world's most popular note-taking and productivity tracking applications to the point where it can slightly get a bit confusing to use. My name is Yudhula, you're watching Gandito Technology and in this video we're talking about how you can sum columns in Notion. So as you can see here, I have a small Notion table with uh, values and numbers. Uh, the good thing about Notion is that we can very quickly deal with this situations because if you hover under the last row of something, you will see this calculate option. And this comes with a bunch of different very handy options here. So number one is count. You can count uh, values, unique values, empty values or non-empty values or you can just count everything. There is percentage. What percentage is empty? What percentage is not empty? And then under more options, you will find mathematical functions like sum, average, median, minimum, maximum and the range. Since we need the sum here, just click on sum and it appears right there. And it will also update dynamically. So as you can see, as I change numbers here, my sum automatically goes up or down. If let's say I make this negative sum value, this will automatically decrease. So yeah, that's how easily you can sum columns in Notion. If you like this video, consider subscribing, give us a thumbs up, press the bell icon and tell us in the comments below what more such videos can we make for you. If you'd like to know more about tech, visit our website candid.technology, follow us on social media, follow me on Instagram or Twitter and we'll see you in the next video.